Hi, this is Taylor Libinati, and today I'm going to show you how to draw boy and girl clothing. So boy clothing is generally uh, very loose and relaxed, which makes it much easier to draw because you have to worry less about the form and more about the actual shape of the cloth. Uh, so I'm going to start with just a very simple t-shirt and jeans concept. For a t-shirt, you can just rough out the basic body and then obviously two directions of where you want the sleeves to come out. Um, the thing that some things that indicate a t-shirt are the loose waviness that come into the bottom and also the collar up at the top. So you can decide where you want those to come in and then ending the t-shirt however long you want it. For the jeans, we're going to try to draw some loose baggy clothes. What that means is that as as you start to map out whether you want them to be standing or with a bent leg or whatever, um, rather than just coming with straight lines down, you can vary it up and have crease lines following throughout. And that'll give it kind of the, the manly, you know, loose jeans fit. Typically with uh, loose clothes like this, the knee area is going to have a lot more wrinkles than anything else. And as they hit the floor, they're going to kind of sprawl out over the feet. So with his other leg here, we'll go ahead and make it a little more bent, but still opening up at the bottom. So once you have the general shape of the jeans plotted out, you can add in things like the zipper coming down or the pockets. A common thing for jeans too is also to have the seam line following the leg. And feel free, I encourage you to experiment with different shapes and forms and way that the jeans and any of these clothings can fall on the body. For female clothing, uh, typically it's more form-fitting. Uh, we'll start out with a simple skirt. A, s a skirt usually falls in a very uh, flowery pattern, if you will, where after coming down the leg, it flows in the bottom. You can indicate that by layering lines. and then trying to keep it close to the body, however you want to draw that. And you can keep the same concept for, if you want to have some sort of spaghetti strap style, low cut or high cut or whatever you want to do with that, maybe a shirt on underneath that follows the arm. This is Taylor Libinati and that's been How to Draw a Boy in Girls Clothing.